Hello, I'm Mendocino County Sheriff Tom Allman. I'm here to talk about an incident that occurred on October 10, 2019, where our deputies were involved in a shooting. The incident took place right here in the 7200 block of Yuva Drive in Redwood Valley, California. The incident is what we consider a critical incident, a situation that we at the Sheriff's Office feel is important to share and be as transparent as possible with you, our community. It started with a 911 call from a resident who reported a man walking on Central Avenue towards Yuva Drive. The caller said the man appeared to be intoxicated. Our deputies did not find a pedestrian, but instead they found 26-year-old Joseph Anthony Corral sitting in a parked vehicle on the 7200 block of Yuva Drive. Corral matched the description given by the 911 caller as a suspect. Our deputy spoke with Mr. Corral. They became concerned that he was intoxicated while sitting behind the steering wheel of his car. After a few minutes of conversation, Mr. Corral rapidly moved his arm behind him towards a backpack and grabbed a Desert Eagle 50 caliber handgun. This photograph shows the actual handgun that Mr. Corral had in his possession during the incident. What I've told you is only a brief synopsis of the incident. What you're about to see is the actual dashboard video, along with audio, from multiple deputies during the encounter with the suspect. Warning, even though Mr. Corral survived the incident, the images that you're about to see are graphic and are not suitable for all viewers. We begin with the actual 911 call in the dispatch that set the entire incident in motion. Are you there? Yes. Okay, what's going on? Well, there's this Mexican fellow, Hispanic fellow. I can't hear you at all. It was. Well, I don't know what to tell you. Are you at the Central? Yeah, and this guy is headed. He he's now walked down to Central Avenue. He's headed north towards Cuba Drive. He's got a backpack and it's full of beer. He's had a few too many. Okay. I don't know where he was. He might be in the vineyard down here now. Do you know what he's wearing besides the backpack? Uh, gray, gray, white T-shirt, uh, black pants, tennis shoes, a black backpack. Yeah, he's still walking down Central, just about to you would drive. Okay. All right. We'll go check for him. Okay. Thank you. Did he say anything, or did he? Um... No, he wasn't really bad. He moved on. Could be trouble for himself, maybe. Okay, you didn't see any weapons or anything, correct? No, I didn't see any weapons, but I could tell his backpack was full of beer. Okay. All right, we'll go check for him, okay? All right, thank you. All right, bye bye. It's a blue van across from 7240 Yuba Drive. How you doing, man? Oh, what yeah. you up to, man? Uh, oh no, I'm sorry about that. Let me lower down the music. No, my car. Uh, my car just died out. I don't know if it's not the gas or the battery. Right here? Yeah. And I'm kind of stuck without a phone, right? Okay. Yeah, so I was just uh, kicking back, waiting until I, I see someone pass by so I could call. call For sure. Uh, get, get your ID on you, boss? My ID? Yeah. What if I check that out real quick? Uh-huh. 
Joseph Corral out of L.A. Never met you before, man. You not from here? Oh, uh, yeah, I am from here. I you are? this was L.A. You think this is L.A.? Yeah. This is not L.A.? This is not L.A. Oh, okay. Should we speak with him for a second? What's going on, man? Hey, how you doing? Good. What are you doing over here? Uh, yeah, like I was telling your friend, uh, my car battery died, or I ha and I have no gas. So I was just waiting so I could call someone. You're seeing anybody or no? No, no, no. No probation for anything like that? No, no, no. You sure? No, no, no. No probation? Yeah, you're in a really bad spot, dude. Huh? You're in a really bad spot. Yeah, the car you're died out close in. there, and then I had someone help me push it over here, so uh, I was in a bad spot. Gotcha. Is that car turned off, boss? You mind taking the keys no, out for me real quick? Not. You mind just taking the keys out? Thanks. Yeah. I thought, that, uh, thought there was a 647F dude okay. walking by. Right uh, How did you get to it here? <clears throat> uh, yeah, I had a woman help me push it over Push it like this? Yeah. Let, got, it, got it. I'll, I'll handle it. Yeah. <clears throat> did you, uh, this is his ID? This is, I, I ran him, but we're waiting on the return. Oh, I see. So, <clears throat> where are you coming from? Where do you, uh, where do you live, dude? Uh, no, I'm coming from, I was just cruising around here. Okay. Where do you live? Where do I live? Mm -hmm. East LA. What's that again? East LA. Okay. When did you get here? Uh, two days ago. Are you, are you visiting someone or? Huh? Are you visiting someone or? What? Oh, no. Okay. Uh -uh. How much did you have to drink today? How much did you drink today? Okay, just do it. Just do what the fuck you gotta do, man. Yeah, well, how, how much do you drink? Just do what the fuck you gotta do. Okay, so you didn't drink anything? Man, no. Nah, just... Alright. Alright, come outside the big man. Where's that gun? 
You got 75. One detained. Are you hit, bud? Find that gun real quick, bud. Find that gun. You got 75. Start medical. Have them stage. That's the firm. Central turns into Yuva. Taser deployed. Hey, you're bleeding, bud. Hey, get someone to put pressure on this. Where's that gun? Is it in there? Uh, I have it. All right, get a towel or something. Someone get pressure on his head. We need pressure. Do you have, do you have a Do you have a uh, medical kit? I do. I do. Where's the medical kit? Right behind my passenger seat. Quick, quick, quick. Just locate the gun real quick. Don't touch anything else. Where are you shot, bud? We need to help you. Where are you shot? There's no one else in there, right? No one else. Okay. I'm gonna get medical coming, code three, right here. You cast him, five. You cast him, five. Yeah, that's too good, bro. Can open your door? You cast him, five. We've got one guy in cuffs, gunshot wounds, we need medical code three. Vasquez, are you alright, bud? Yeah, I'm good. We need that medical kit. Yeah. Sorry. Quick, quick, quick. He's not working here. I don't know what happened to my key. Open that. Open that car. Hey! I need you to check on those people. Please. Yeah. Fucking you got this? run. Yes. I have a hollow to it. Okay. Check on the people. Make sure no one's shot over there. Make sure no one's shot. Yes. Run, run, run. Uh, quick, quick, quick. The Behind the passenger seat. Uh, Stay seated. Stay seated. You're shot, bud. Don't move. Don't move. Here we go. Where's he shot at? I don't know. His, his head's fucking leaking. And he's, he's leaking in the front, too. Right here. So we should fucking pressure somewhere. His head's fucking leaking, though. Here, don't move, bro. Don't move. Don't move. Don't move. Turn over! We're trying to fucking help you, dude. We're try your head's... Hey! Your head's fucking bleeding. Stop. Your head's fucking bleeding, bud. I'm gonna put pressure on it. Fuck. We're uh, just stop traffic if you would. Yeah. Send people out of the way. Obviously, it's a fucking, hey, it's a huge crime a scene. Uh, no, I have not searched completely. I mean, I should get a better okay. search on him. Right. No more guns. He's still no. You rolling your way? Yeah. All right, man. I'm gonna back up and block this traffic. Sounds good. It's gonna be shot for a while. I got pressure on it. <laughs> nothing else. Are you sure there's nothing else. Well, we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to stand him up. Here. You're good, bud. You're bleeding, we gotta help you. Everybody okay? Don't fight us.
Whenever our deputies use force or discharge their service weapons, multiple investigations are automatically initiated. The Mendocino County District Attorney's Office is investigating the use of force by our deputy sheriffs. The Mendocino County Sheriff's Office is investigating the actions of the suspect. And in addition, the Mendocino County Sheriff's Office Internal Affairs Division is investigating to determine if the deputy's actions align with the department policy on the use of deadly force. The Mendocino County Sheriff's Office takes any use of force very seriously and every incident is reviewed carefully. This was a traumatic experience for everyone involved. Our attempt is to present this material without coming to any conclusion as the investigation is still underway. As your Mendocino County Sheriff, I am genuinely concerned about community safety, the safety of law-abiding visitors, and the safety of our dedicated law enforcement officers. Thank you for your attention and your willingness to watch this critical incident video.